What's going on YouTube? We got some news for All-Star Week program and MLB The Show 24, and it's great news. This brings a lot of excitement to the game, and it should. We get a new team affinity with 95 overalls, not 93s. Wish they were 97s, especially how long it took for Chapter 2 to come out, but still 95s are very, very good. That will include Juan Soto, Garrett Crochet, and Marcus Simeon. On top of that, 70 plus Diamond Dynasty cards, new Diamond Dynasty star cards for All-Star Week will be coming, including 30 new team affinity cards, all-Star Week Collection featuring 99 overall rewards, MLB Draft, Home Run Derby, and All-Star Game Choice Packs. I know you hear the word packs, but listen to the rest of it because it gets pretty good. MLB Draft Conquest Map, All-Star Week Program, and Hall of Fame Evolution Programs featuring 99 overall rewards. Well, you'll start with a 91 and he'll have an evolution of to 99 over. You'll be able to complete Team Infinity faster than ever before with higher reward missions, American League and National League conquest maps, extreme moments, and more. To help kickstart your journey, you can complete the 2024 All-Star missions listed first in each of the Team Infinity programs in just one Diamond Dynasty game. And to give you a little tip of what the mission will look like, like the strikeouts with the Braves, you only need one strikeout with one Brave and you're done. Now the strikeouts with the Marlins, probably the same. You need one strikeout. The total bases, probably like one or two total bases with that, with that team. Very, very easy to do. And you'll be able to unlock the first boss card for Team Infinity just by completing that mission in one game. All-Star Week Collection Rewards. Our fourth wild card slot. Our future skilled showcase winner. One top 10 2024 MLB draft pick. A 2024 MLB draft choice pack. A home run derby choice pack. An all-star game choice pack. And a 99 overall 2024 all-stars. And more. So we're getting 99s overall. We're getting all those choice packs that are going to be in the show shop for free. But that's not all. There's still more choice packs that we're going to be able to earn. On Saturday, MLB's Future Skills Showcase is coming to MLB The Show 24 and an all-new card series. Seven participants will be available to be redeemed for free in the show shop by Monday, July 15th, with a winner being featured in the All-Star Week collection. These cards will be an easy way to boost your progress through that collection and will help you make your way towards those 99 overalls. So seven free cards. And then the collection card, the winner of the event, will be featured in the collection for absolutely free. Sunday, July 14th, following its debut in MLB The Show 23, the MLB Draft returns to MLB The Show 24. Finally, new drafted players in MLB The Show 24 for the first time ever, just a few hours following the MLB Draft. You can earn the MLB Draft Pack in the All-Star Collection and an exclusive Top 10 Draft Pick Player Card as we add new tiers of rewards in the collection throughout the week. Free cards from the MLB Draft. We'd love to see it. So not only can you buy the pack in the store, you can earn the pack free in the program or collection. On Monday, looking for more draftees before the Home Run Derby begins, play through the new 2024 MLB Draft. Conquest map to earn even more players from the draft. A choice pack containing more draftees will be rewarded after completing the full conquest map. And the map is repeatable. The map is repeatable. That means can we earn that draft E multiple times? Can the final reward be earned more than once? And it looks like it can. So that is huge. This pack will feature different MLB draft players in the 2024 MLB draft choice pack featured in other areas of Diamond Dynasty. Remember, as you collect more of these players, you will unlock more rewards than the 2024 All-Star Collection. A scheduled roster update on Monday, July 15th will also feature draftees on their respective MLB rosters so you can add these newly drafted players to your franchise roster. In the evening, we'll be watching some of the MLB's top sluggers hit moonshots, find the Home Run Derby champion, runner-up, and the rest of the participants in the Home Run Derby choice pack available in the show shop. You can earn the choice pack as a new reward in the 2024 All-Star Collection with a late night 
content drop. Love to see that. Cheer on your players during the All-Star Game. The All-Star Game Choice Pack will be loaded with even more 2024 All-Stars who splash under the spotlights, including the 2024 All-Star MVP. Once again, the pack will be available in the show shop and as a featured reward for collecting other 2024 series players in the All-Star Collection following the late night content update. So we're getting late night collection updates. I love to see it. It's going to make it hype waiting for those updates to go live as we're watching the All-Star Games and Home Run Derby. July 17th, a fan favorite program is returning. Relive the biggest moments, completed theme missions, and play through the 2020-24 All-Star Game event. Event goes live Friday, July 12th to complete the 2024 All-Star Week program for exclusive cards. Earn a guaranteed rare round choice pack composed of the MLB Draft Home Run Derby and All-Star Game Choice Pack Rare Rounds. Upon finishing the program, will you add the 2024 number one overall MLB draft pick, the Home Run Derby winner, or the 2024 All-Star Game MVP to your squad? We get an option of the Rare Round, which will be basically including the winner or the MVP of that perspective. Uh, program and then on sunday celebrate the national baseball hall of fame class of 2024 inductees including adrian beltre todd helton and joe mauer in three all new hall of fame evolution programs evolution programs are coming back releasing after the ceremony all three programs will reward multiple cards leading to a 99 overall version of the new inductees upon collect, uh, completion. The only thing I wish that these cards were, I wish they were core cards because they're Hall of Fame cards. They go to a 99. It, br- it would bring up the hype of more of unlocking or at least the 99 overall version of the card, I think should be a core card. We can't see the 99 overall. Maybe there's a reason for that. Maybe it is a core card, but it doesn't look like it. It looks like it's going to be a season two card. So that's like the only downside I see about this so far is that the Evolution Program 99 is going to be a Season 2 card instead of a Core card. And just before we let you guys go, they want to let us know that Season 2 of Chapter 3 of Team Affinity releases on Friday, August 2nd, featuring an all-new card series. So we can look forward to another all-new card series. I'm excited for that. But let me know, guys, in the comments down below, what do you guys think of this all-star content? I think it's a huge W. We get a lot of free packs. We get a free rare round of a pack. Pretty huge W right there. Uh, Be sure to like, subscribe for new, turn notifications on so you guys don't miss out on all of the all-star content coming. Be sure to follow me on Twitch, TikTok, all that stuff. will be live over there when the content is going live. And I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks for watching.